In this video, I will show you how to add a label to a TK Inter window using Python. Going on to show you some of the attributes of the label that can be set. These have been considered earlier in the playlist. The program statement just coming into view is how you create a label. If you look at this, you can see it uses TK, which is defined here, dot notation, and this is the name of the label class. This is the name I have chosen to be bound to the label that's created here. These are the arguments that are passed to this. If we look here, we can see that we're setting the text attribute of the label to hello world. This informs the label as to which window it is to be associated with, my underscore window which was declared here. So the label created on this line is going to be associated with the window created on this line. This will pack the label onto the window it is associated with. When it executes you'll see this and you can clearly see the label displaying hello world. Now, if you consider this bit of the code, which is responsible for creating the label, and we bring it down here and look at what I'm going to do to the code now, I'm going to replace this by what you can see here. You can see I've added a comma, and here I've made relief assigned solid. If we run the amended code, what we're going to see is this, and look to the label, and you can see it's got a solid outline as defined by this in the code. Consider this part of the computer program, which I will move to here. I will amend this code, as you can see here. I've put another comma, and here I've made the border equal to 4. This is the computer program showing the amendment, and when this executes, what we're going to see is this, the window and the label. And look at the outline of the label, you can see it's thicker. I've amended the program again by making border equal to 10. Look at the label, and you can see the outline is even thicker. From the examples considered, it should be quite clear what border is for. You can see here that I've altered the relief to raised, and when you look to the label, you can see the different outline shape that you get. The amendment is shown here where the relief is made equal to sunken, and have a look at the shape of the outline of the label. When you make the relief groove, you can see that the label has a groove round the outline. Here I've made the relief ridge, and have a look at the label, and you can see the outline is a ridge. These show some typical examples of the value relief can take up, and for these values, the look of the labels will be as you can see appearing now. Pause the video. Note down this exercise and have a go at completing it. Please consider subscribing to the channel and click the bell to ensure you get an update every time I upload a video. Maybe you would like to consider supporting the development of these free videos via Patreon. In addition, why not follow me on Twitter and also check out the supporting website.